Hey, how's it going everybody? Dan here for the first episode of my Torchlight 2 series. Um, yeah, so I did play the first Torchlight, and um, at the time I played it, it was just after Diablo 3. Uh, well, actually I owned it way before then, I didn't play it too much, but then whenever Diablo 3 came out, I, um, I mean after I got finished with Diablo 3, kind of was just not into it. It, it felt dated, and... Um, that that's not, it wasn't bad. It just it just definitely felt dated. Did not enjoy it too much. But anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get started with Torchlight 2. As you can tell, I'm gonna be playing as an engineer. And decided I'll show you guys like the creation process just to show you what kind of um, customization they offer in the game. I think I'll go with that, and we'll go with white hair. I don't know if I like that hair though. Bald. Mm. Let's see. Yeah, we'll we'll go with this. We'll go with the goggles. And we'll, the character name is going to be Dan. And uh, yes, I want to stick with the cat, I think. I mean, look, at, there's all these pets. I don't really think they do anything uh, very special, but I want a cat just because I like cats. So, yes, and no, it's not going to be Professor. It will be named Waffle. Waffle the cat. And um, play a normal and single player. I kind of want to play online at some time, but for you know, for the sake of this let's play and everything, I'm definitely going to keep it in single player. Anyways, let's see what Deep this cinematic has light, to tell us. A darkness gathered. Three heroes confronted the beast called Ordrock. Yet even in death, Ordrock's corrupted heart endured and called out. Heroes may fall, hope may fade, but new heroes will rise. Okay, well, uh, let's go ahead and get started. Already kind of uh, like the look of all this. What's your business here? Uh, okay, I guess saying stuff. Anyways, you a new recruit? No, not really. What's no. your business over here? I think so, this yeah. is as far as I can go. You should carry on to the Asterian uh -huh. Enclave, but you're on your own. Warn them that the Alchemist destroyed Torchlight and is headed their way. He may be there. Okay, anyways. Um, volume seems a little bit loud. Not too loud, though. We'll, we'll just go down a little bit. Alright, so, um, yeah, as far as my experience with action RPGs goes, it's I've actually played quite a bit. From uh, actually dating back to the original Diablo, used to be a huge fan of that series. Um, I, I played it a lot, <laughs> and uh, Diablo 2 played it a lot. And honestly, a lot of it has just mainly been within the Diablo series. Uh, give me that chest, a light tunic. Let's see, I wonder how the inventory system works in this. Okay, auto equip works for me. Whatever, don't care. But yeah, so my plan to do. Uh, 
my plan. Yes, okay, my mana. Uh, is to do a just just the first playthrough or, or the the whole campaign. I'm not gonna do a um, a playthrough of all the difficulties or anything. Just just the first. I think it's about 12 hour campaign. Ooh, what are these guys? Critical pitch. Um, okay. Sure, thank you. Select an autumn reward. I want... I can either have enchanted boots or whatever. Pet tags. Can only be worn by pets. Plus four physical damage. I kind of like this. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll, we'll go with that. 165 fame. Just want we'll to get used to how this game works. Sweet, I've reached level two. Electric ring? You've leveled up. Press the level up button on the side of your screen. Okay, where's the level up? Ah, here it is. Let's see what we've got going on. We've got construction, blitz, and Aegis. So, Aegis, I'm guessing, yeah, that looks definitely like a tank type thing. Uh, construction. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Healing bot. Blast cannon. Spider mines. Huh. That's, I kind of like that. And this seems like your typical melee type of character with all the awesome skills. You know what? I don't know. I'm thinking Aegis possibly or construction. Deploy a small drone that generates energy pulses healing both you and your allies. Uh, I'd definitely be awesome on the online games. Let's see what this is. Your expertise with armor lets you get the most out of it. Increasing its effectiveness and reducing any damage that actually gets through. Oh, I just, I don't know. I don't know. I guess uh, well what, let me look at some of them you fire long range long range sledge sledge bot you construct a powerful sledge bot I don't really want to do anything with pets so I'm thinking this uh, no you know what just screw it I'm just gonna go with this right here there we go we got flame hammer what's this your giant your skill with giant weaponry allows you to attack faster and adds a chance to send your foes sure I like that and um I know that the okay 48 sweet let's go with that I, and I know that that you cannot respec in this game you can only respec the last three skills that you put in so that's kind of dated but you know whatever that, that's what they wanted to do I guess it works um, who knows maybe they'll patch that shine of shrine not shine what's a pagoda -gado? a pagoda <laughs> I don't know what I was just trying to say but whatever Let's go. Come on. What are you guys? Like a crocodile type thing? I don't. I don't know. I love the look of this game, though. I mean, it's not got that dark look like Diablo has, but you know what? I'm completely fine with that. More electric rings. Whatever. Okay, let's go down here. I have more of these guys. I, I will eventually look at the name of those. What is that? I just get shot or something? Ratlins. Ratlins are kind of cool. I don't know if my cat just killed them or if I did. Looked more like my cat did though. <sighs> oh, no, no. Come here. Stop doing that. Oh, wait. So, I mean, obviously as you can tell, there's also the whole, um, the skills are going to work a lot different than they do in Diablo, which I'm okay with. Not, I mean, I kind of love what they did. Oh, golden key, whatever. Um, you have discovered a socketable item. Awesome. Health potion, give me. But, I, I kind of like the system in Diablo 3 a little bit better, but, you know what, as soon as I get used to this, I'll probably like it. This game feels fluid, feels good, that was the biggest problem I had with the first one. To me, it just did not feel, feel good to play it. I mean, it felt good to play it, it just didn't feel as fluid as it should have. Um, what the crap. You have discovered a magical item. It's an, an unidentified. Uh, unidentified items, that's kind of old too. I mean, I know part of the fun is actually identifying an item and hoping that it's awesome. Oh, okay, that's kind of cool how that works. Let's see what we've got to choose from. I'll probably just go ahead and increase my flame hammer since I'm using it a lot. I'll go ahead and look in the inventory. Uh, obviously don't need that. Chaos in respect, armor, trinkets, plus... Plus one M to both, but I don't know what one M is. Some possibly something with, uh, yeah. 
So, uh, okay. <laughs> Sturm Bureau. I don't even know how to say that. Whatever. Or requires level six. Sure, let's go ahead with that. I don't have anything else there. Plus eight poison armor, plus eight. Okay, that's kind of cool. Nah, I'm just gonna put that in there. Okay. That's kind of cool too, but I don't want to slot that into anything I have. It's probably not worth it. Sweet, I think I can... I don't know if I should. No, I, I don't. I don't think so. I, I, I kind of want to keep just that. Don't need a, uh, a ranged weapon. I'm gonna stay melee. Okay, um... Don't really know if I'm going the right way, but you know what? It doesn't matter. I'm having fun just going everywhere. Let's see. What the crap is this place? Ah, uh, oh, give me that health potion. My business is to go over here. Passive skills. Yes, that's how passive usually works. Unspent what points? I'm confused. Is there something that I'm supposed to know that I don't know right now? To echo, echo, whatever. Don't care. For some reason, my eyes are just not focusing on things at the moment. I thank you for your warning, but it has arrived too late. This alchemist has already come and gone, and it was all I could do to prevent him from entering the enclave. As it was, many Astellians were injured. And since the confrontation, several more have become ill. We are not sure what his commander Vale believes that the alchemist might attack the Wellspring Temple in an attempt to reach the Guardian of Water. For what nefarious purpose I am afraid to speak. Let's go look at some water. Hey. I like I like when people talk to me. Um hey. Ooh. What's your business here? Uh, okay, you can use my help. Do you think you might be able to get in there and grab the armor schematic? Sure, why not? You have received a quest. Ha -ha. You just get here? What's this? The temple steps via. Okay, quest. Both of them. Unspent stat points. Oh, stat points. What am I? I'm, I'm so stupid. Why didn't I? <laughs> Duh. Come on now. Um, I guess we... I kind of like this. I like being able to choose what I want to put my stats into. Um, I'm looking more towards strength, obviously. Oh, wait. Wait, can I, can I not do this? No? So I can only go over here. Okay, interesting. I like how this works, in a way. I don't know if I should go straight up weapon damage. I don't really want to go crit and dodge. I don't really care. And I don't want to go magic damage. I guess armor is something that I need to go into. But I want to stick with ma mainly with weapon damage. Hopefully I don't build myself too too wrong honestly don't know anything that's going on just kind of taking it as it goes oh well I guess we'll know if I'm if I'm wrong whenever we get to the get to the harder parts of the game ah come on why, why was it even up, available to go up there there's nothing to do up there smash everything So yeah, I mean, as far as combat goes, there's definitely no innovation here at all. Even from the last game, there's not much, but uh, it, it's it's fun, you know, and you can't argue with fun. <laughs> well, I guess you can if you're one of those people that don't want to enjoy anything, but stop being one of those people if you are one of those people. I've been obsessed with like 10 minute parts recently, but hey, I'm going to keep, keep letting this part go a little bit longer just because... Uh, well, I mean, it's the first part of the game. Ooh, pocket pistol? Whatever, sure. And uh, I kind of like to have my, my first parts a little bit longer than usual. What is this down here? Engineer charge bar. Okay. Interesting. I don't know if it does anything useful. All right, let's go kill some more skeletons. Die. I wish I had some like barbarian leap ability because that's what I played in Diablo 3, a barbarian, and I got so addicted to the to the motion or, or to the um, mobility that I had to just jump in and out of crowds direct and um, also draw crowds to me. Of course, which I'm only on like I'm only level three, so it'd be kind of pointless to give me all that ability at the moment. Whoa, that was new. Oh, okay, that's from the charge. I, I see. 
kind of, I kind of get it a little bit more now. Come over here. I don't know if there's a point in these little skeleton, um, little walkways top things. I guess. Hey, stop hitting me! Oh, level up. Oh, hey, this guy's following me. I should probably kill him so he'll stop following me. Oh, come here. Smash. I love killing all these skeletons just because they die so easily. And there's a quest around here. Enter the corrupted crypt. I need your help. <sighs> okay. Um Sure, let's let's go into here and do that. And Oh, I have unspent stat points and skill points. That's right, I leveled up. I completely forgot about that. I don't know how I forgot that I leveled up when it just happened. Anyways, let's go with uh, another one of these, just because that seems to be the thing to do right now. That's uh, it meows. Oh my god, that makes me like it even more. Sure, that works. All right. Do 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 do. For some reason, it feels like I'm moving faster now. Are there any breakable? Uh, okay, I figured that would break, but I guess not. Oh, hey, it's you. <clears throat> ah, my voice or my throat's getting a little annoying. <clears throat> ah. Who knows what epic encounters we will uh, have inside of this place, I guess, or dungeon. I don't really know what I'm doing because this falls under the category that most online games or most uh, games like this where you don't really read the quest, you just kind of, I mean I try to read some of the quests, sometimes I'll pretend like I'm reading the quest, but I may not actually be reading the quest. If you, if that's your thing though, you can always pause it and see what's going on with it. I'll definitely watch the cinematics and listen to the main points though, but anything just not worth listening to, yeah, definitely not going to be spending too much time with it. Starting to get hit quite a bit. What are these guys doing over here? Stupid mages. God. Give me my gold. Let's pick up some top of boots. Don't really know. Man. That was wasted. Xandus. Skeleton warriors everywhere. What is this? What did I just do? Oh, okay. It's a. Uh, I have no clue what that thing is, but he lets me do stuff, so that's kind of cool. Uh oh, better heal. Definitely got a little bit too low on health there. Probably need to keep uh, <laughs> keep a closer watch on that. Ah, what's this? Health potion and a flame ember spec. So the gems are called specs, or maybe they are called gems as well. I don't know. And smash. And oh, he's already dead. <sighs> Ooh, lots of gold. Ooh, and and items and stuff. Gold is always good. Items are always good. What was that? Oh God. Stop hitting me. Kind of, I really like the flame hammer spell. It's just fun to go and um, smack the crap out of enemies with it. Staff, don't really care about the staff. Let's go over here. Oh, okay. Something down there. I don't really think I can go down there. Oh god. I have no clue where all these people came from. Stop shooting me. God. Earns more. Earns. When I say the word earn, I think I'm saying like one of my friend's name, which is Aaron. Earn. Anyways, <laughs> that was a little random. Shattered. I don't. I guess shattered means that, that they are shattered. I mean, obviously it means that. I don't know if it's like a special type of damage thing or if it's bad for me, good for them, bad for them, good for me. Who knows? I haven't read that much into it. Oh god. Emik Zaluth. 
Die. There we go. Level up, Lumber Axe, Bracers, Mana Potion. Fallen Guardian. What is that? What are you doing up there? Oh, I thought they were doing something. They just look like they're just waving up there, though. Sweet, you should have died, though. Oh, come on. That's no fair. Light Mantle. I thought that said Light Waffle. Okay, let's go down here to the Fallen Guardian, wherever that is. And, uh, oh yeah, I leveled. <laughs> I really like leveling in this game. Unlock. Uh, sure, we'll go with this. And the skill points. Oh, I think I want to go with some, I want to get that up to 30, and then I'll just put one in Vitality. Looks like my main thing is definitely going to be Strength and Vitality, obviously. I don't know if there's one I should just focus on completely. I don't really care. I'm just going to play the game, not worry about it. And that's a lot of stuff about to come up. Come on. Really wish my uh, engineer meter was up a little bit. Oh, now we got Zico Luzanic. My god, who who designed these characters' names or came up with them? Some ridiculous names. Give me my cloth pack. Give me my health potion. I enough mana. Not enough mana. Well, guess what? Now you do. About to not have enough health. Ooh, lots of stuff. Unidentified pants. Well, let's identify those pants. Soon. Not now. Just sometime. <sighs> oh, looks like we got another chest. Sweet. More gold. Light military boots. More pants and light... Okay. Let's see if we got anything we can use. Obviously, we can use this. Yeah, I would say so. Um, Mighty tunic. Don't really care for that. Don't care for that. Don't really care for most of this. And, um... Yeah, so I'm not really going to spend too much time. Plus 7 poison damage. I kind of like that. Uh, you know what, I'll just stick with the hammer I've got. Die. Oh, uh, uh, there's something, there's something shooting at me. Oh god, where are all these guys? They're shocking me. Oops, I didn't mean to use the mana potion like I just did. Die. Aw oh, man, I should have saved it. Whoa. Fallen Guardian? Is he the boss? I don't know what he is, but you know what? I'm going to kill him. Not like I have much of a choice to sit here and just take it. Die. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Quest complete. I, I think purple is quest items. That's the only thing I can think of. Hopefully there's something completed a quest. Waypoint portal scroll to return directly to town. Hmm. Probably should get one of those somewhere. However, we still got a little bit of uh, dungeon left, so we'll see where it takes us. What the crap's that noise? Rats? Those are some loud rats. Let's gain a little bit more experience by fighting these things down here. Always up for more experience. As you can tell, I'm also about to level, so, well, kind of. I'm not too far away from leveling. Health potion. Yes, you die. Oops, did not mean to open that up. Give me that gold. Don't want to pass up much of the gold. Portal to surface. That is that is exactly what I'm looking for. Walking staff and chaos ember spec. Okay. Oh, thanks. Yay, now what do I get to choose from? I get to choose from five health still to master on hit. Hmm, that's a pet thing. Ash Scythe. I kind of like that. That's kind of cool, actually. But it requires level 14 or strength 36. Average attack speed, 14. Yeah, I, I, I like this, but I don't think it's for... I think it's more for a uh, other person, not for me. I think I'll go with that. That's, that seems fair. Alright, guys. Well, that's going to be all for this part. Just a 
got kind of get a awesome uh, awesome <laughs> anyways kind of to get a decent look at the game just to you know see what's coming up in this and also just see if it's kind of a game that you would want to buy I can tell you just from this first uh, 25 minutes or so that I've been playing it's definitely worth getting just because I mean it feels great it's um, definitely gonna be a fun game I can already tell I've even looked up much information on it but yeah thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next part